Oh, hi there. My name's Timmy Joe, making videos about computers on the internet. Today, I've been just rummaging about the new set, checking it out, uh, still kind of fine-tuning things, but here we are making videos, and this is fun. I think it looks pretty good. I got the lights all set up pretty good. I got some things and some stuff. Anyways, uh, today on the program, I want to talk about Crossfire and my hard troubles I've been having getting this going in this PC. Basically, I have two 7970s. One is the original OG. You know, it's like a really slow 925 megahertz. The other one is the gigahertz edition that's overclocked uh, 125 megahertz beyond that. And in every single configuration, I cannot get it to work. At first, I didn't realize I needed a Crossfire bridge. This is one of the last versions you'd need one with. And I ordered one on Amazon, fire it in here. Uh, still not getting in the newest drivers the option to set up Crossfire. Uh, it doesn't show up at all. And there's no, not even like a little tick that just says like, you know, it gives you any hint that you're doing anything wrong. It's just not there. So I downloaded some really old drivers uh, and at least they're helpful. I got uh, Catalyst Control Center, it's like version 15, something like that. And when you go into the Crossfire settings, it sees the cards that actually even prompts that there's a Crossfire possibility, you know, set up there. But when you click it, it says the AMD Crossfire internal bridge interconnects linking your graphics cards together are not properly attached. Both bridge interconnects must be attached. For more information, see the user guide of your graphics card. So uh, I have looked everywhere and it actually, most of the time in uh, forums and in pictures of people using these two cards to crossfire, there's only one bridge and people say, don't use two bridges, cause that's bad. I have uh, it on good authority that I should only need one bridge but in every configuration, whether it's the good card on top, the bad card on top, the bridge between, you know, uh, switched around, you know, this, that, the other thing, nothing works. And I was hoping somebody out there in internet land has some experience with Crossfire, could give me a little uh, helping me do. In the meantime, I have ordered another Crossfire bridge, but I'm getting so fed up with trying to get this going, at least on this motherboard, because I have all this water cooling gear, um, this is going to be the pump. Got that from Enermax. It's RGB and has adjustable, uh, you know, settings for the RPMs and stuff. And I'm using this PC for that build, but it's the only way I can do this crossfire video. Uh, and if it's filled with, you know, tubes and water, it's not going to be a fun time to try and get other graphics cards in it. So the time is running out. I thought I'd throw this out there on the internet, show you guys a little bit of the strife I've been dealing with trying to get these cards going. And if I could get any help, that would be lovely. But from, you know, uh, from what I can tell, I have it all set up properly. And the 79, you know, sh should just down clock itself, the gigahertz edition to match the other one so that we can do some crossfire uh, and we're not having any fun. And then we can manually overclock them afterwards. It's just not working and I could use some help. So thanks very much for watching. This is Timmy Joe. Hope you guys can help me out. And uh, sorry, I got it. I just went to the dentist today. I'm dying. Uh, but I'm down here and I'm uh, just about to scrap this whole crossfire on the uh, Intel board thing and start the water cooling build. So I thought before I did that, I'd throw this out into internet land and maybe we can get some help. Have a nice day. See you guys in another video. Lots of stuff coming up soon. And I'll see you guys in another, yeah, I already said that. God, God damn it. Ah.